Hello everybody, XJO81X here, and on the tubes today, I'm going to be showing you a thrift store find. This is the GE Digital Clock Radio with battery backup. This was found for $5 at a local thrift store. And uh, actually my wife found it. She was uh, just shopping, doing other things, and she saw the uh, you know, 80s, 90s wood grain, and for 5 bucks, she brought it home. I think it was a great find. She, of course, plugged it in at the store, and they were more than helpful to obviously make sure that everything was working properly. So we'll just plug this right in. You got your display. On the top left, you have a sleep button, a wake button, an hour button, a minute button. On the top here, you have an on, off music alarm. So uh, we'll just set a random time, we'll say, uh, oh, you just hit the hour, excuse me, sorry. We'll say it's about 4 a.m., no problem. And uh, before we just, you know, we'll just throw in a minute for video purposes. It's 4.10 a.m. When you click the on button, it turns on the radio. get a channel here. Oh, AM, FM, yeah, that's fine. Random channel, doesn't matter. Doesn't seem to be working. Whatever. Volume. Snooze doesn't work because it's on. So you shut it off. And then when you want to listen to music, 59 minutes goes by. And then you hit the snooze. The funny part is, is look at the word snooze. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong, but I can be wrong. Should there be an E at the end of it? There's no remnants of it ever being there. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> so, uh, to the left, there's nothing. I already took the screws out. To the back, there's nothing. And there's a volume button tuning AM, FM. We'll show you underneath. Right where my left thumb is, is the model number 7-4612B, as in boy. And on the bottom right... The date code is 2245K as in King, made in Malaysia. JK18 told me that that might be the date code, might be the 22nd week in 1994, which bring you, brings you to May. Please correct me if I'm wrong, or if you oblige so happily, please uh, teach me or send me in the right direction of how to re read these date codes. I did try to do an internet search, but it wasn't really too helpful. I did put the model number in to Google, and it showed, uh, you know, 1,000 pictures, and it said it was a 1993 model, and there are some YouTube videos of this. There's a 9-volt battery cover, got no battery, and then there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Well, uh take the cover off oh, excuse me you have to remove the volume in order to make the cover come off well there it is there you go set that aside set this nicey nice and I'll just pop it open corset Okay, here we go. This just has plastic snooze. There's no film in the speaker. Sometimes it came with film, depending on what might make and model and error. Two screws takes these out. One screw takes this takes that out. It's pretty much that's all right there. Okay, here's the inside with the power on. <laughs> I won't touch anything. Please pause. 
if you notice anything here's the buttons there's the on off uh, there's the volume control and is the um, uh, um, AM FM tuner and there's the AM FM button and then their speaker does come out but doesn't go far I can't read you what it is because there's a felt on the bottom I already looked at it so the speaker just kind of sits where it has been sitting this whole time obviously power is up here and um, that's really it there's your uh, digital display and uh, we'll set the alarm hold on I have the alarm set for 417 going to put the volume button no, I guess I could do it right here yeah, maybe I'll put it on a little bit just the volume button just so when it turns to 17 I'll turn it low I'll turn it a little bit high Now, yes, you could turn it to music gingerly here. Obviously, whatever station. And then you could bring it back to alarm. And then you could hit the snooze button which would be this one right here and I discovered that it's right here there it is snooze button was this black button right here so with that out of the way that's the alarm and then obviously you just turn it up you don't know what it is because it's when you wake up you turn it to on and then back off one turns it to off incidentally there is obviously a wake indicator there but you know that the alarm is currently on or it was on but it would be on and it would go off obviously in 24 hours so thanks everybody for watching if I missed anything or you'd like to see see something more of this clock please leave your comments below thanks for watching again hit like hit subscribe and this is the review of the thrift store fine GE digital clock radio from the 90s.